Hey guys, welcome and welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all well. I'm in this video, <laughs> I tried so hard not to get distracted, but you're making me feel awkward. Oh, this spot is really painful on my hair. Anyway, I haven't done a what I eat in a few days for a while, so I thought this is a perfect opportunity to do it. For my breakfast, I've got cake and grapes, which is literally so good. I had cake and strawberries yesterday, but then mom ate all the strawberries last night, so. I'm having grapes instead. I really like, you know, like the the juicy combo with the chocolate. It's so good. What are two things you can't have for breakfast? Grapes and cake. No. I have no idea. Lunch and dinner. Ah, <laughs> that's quite cute actually. Because they're saying you can have anything you want for breakfast. Because again, obviously you can. You can just call it breakfast, can't you? I'm okay, baby. I'm gonna eat on my cake. It's so good because it's been my mum's birthday, my dad's birthday, and Father's Day all within like a space of like ten days. We've had like a lot of cake, so it's just been pretty, pretty bloody brilliant to be honest. I'm gonna tuck in. It's so good. Bon appetit. Hey guys, so it's later on and I'm doing my makeup, but I feel really packaged already. So I'm having some potato sticks, you know the ones that are like really thin? Like you can literally put in like 10 in one mouthful. I'm eating them. They are so good. <laughs> hey guys, so I left my camera in the car, so I'm currently on the phone. I've got this little smoothie. I can't actually remember what's in it. I think it's strawberry, mango, kiwi, banana. Banana. And it's a blended with apple juice, so we'll do a little taste test on the cam. I think that person in the back is just like giving it a bit. Oh my god, that's so good. Do you want to try it? I'm with Connie. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> it's really good. It's actually really good with muffin break, so highly recommend. And then Connie has got this little muff, and I, I'm going to try it. If that's okay. <laughs> <laughs> no. Yeah. So sure. what should I do? Just break some yeah. Whatever you want. Thanks, girlie. Oh, nice. This does look good. Oh, wow. So moist. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. So me and Connie are actually gonna share, but it sort of looks like this is gonna be more mine and that's gonna be more Connie's. We've got garlic dongles and a cheesy garlic bread. I'm so excited. Literally could eat cheesy garlic bread all day, every day. So it's so good. So I've got this bolognese and I added chicken into it as well. I'm really full from the pizza, not gonna lie, and I've also got some fries. And then Connie's got this chicken milanese. It looks so good. I'm a little jealous. What's in that? Garlic butter oh. chips. Oh. See, they said they're rosemary chips, but they're just fried. But I mean, they're just normal fries. But yeah, we're gonna scram this in our tummies. It's gonna be so good. So now I've got some cookie dough ice cream. That's what I was asking if you wanted. Oh no, it's, I've left it on the side if you want some. Um, and I've got caramel sauce on. I would just usually eat it out the tub, but I wanted loads of caramel sauce, so I've put it in a bowl and then I've just left it out. So if I want more, I'm gonna come back. But I just love caramel sauce, it's so good. Hey guys. Ooh. So it's a day after, and obviously yesterday I finished filming quite early from what I was eating and that's because on the evening I got really ill like it's really weird and like it's the day after it's like 11 a.m. I feel like I've got a really bad headache and like blocked nose and sore throat and achy body and like it's just horrible and so I really didn't have any appetite last night sometimes sometimes when I'm ill I actually want to eat more in this case my throat has a really weird taste that is giving me like no cravings it's really weird so for my breakfast I've got a bowl of straws and then I'm also having a corner yogurt. I don't want you guys to think that I usually don't eat this as much because yesterday I would have eaten more at night, but I really feel like ass. Ah, so I have a temperature and it has made me feel really guilty that I'm not like doing anything, like I'm not editing or doing anything. I literally just watched a Love Island last night, which is so not like me. I wanted to go to the gym and I wanted to edit last night, but I didn't. And like I'm just allowing myself just to have this time just to like relax and like try and get better because if I force my way through stuff, I'll just feel even worse. It's not my fault that I feel like this. Yeah, I'm gonna eat my breakfast and I'll get back to you guys in a bit. I love you. It's like hurting to swallow. This is really horrible. I'm in so much pain. I just feel like shit. I don't know what to do. So I've been sat outside and going in the really cold pool because my temperatures are so bad. My tan is coming along. So excited. The weather is so good here at the minute. But I've had like Lemsip 2 um, cold and flu tablets and no spray. So I don't know. Maybe I've had a little bit too much. But you know. I've just put in the agar a breadstick. Do you know what I've been loving at the minute? Cheese twists. The Unreal. But we've run out and mum tried to get some more for me. But 
where should I lint this album? Or oh, they're out of stock or something. But anyway, I'm basically just gonna like slide this, slice this up and then butter it up on both sides because butter makes bread phenomenal. And then add a bit of salt. <coughs> Bottle apple teeth, boys and girls. Ben has gone to the gym and I really wanted to go with him. And it, obviously I wanted to go last night as well. I think that if I go, I just feel like it would make me feel more ill. Like I just think I'd get really out of breath and everything. So obviously I do feel a bit guilty about not going, which is a bit silly because I shouldn't feel like that. But I definitely do want to go, but it's not my fault. And like I could just go tomorrow and I don't need to go to the gym like just because i've planned going like i can just go for the moment and if i don't want to go even if i've planned it like that's fine and you know you, people get ill and you just have to like work around it like you can't go to the gym for ill because you just gonna make yourself worse i sliced it all up i'm gonna put my butter on and go and enjoy this while chilling by the pool as i should you know as i should here is my beautiful little snack it looks so good i'm so excited to eat this what would be so good is having some oil and balsamic but i don't think we have any balsamic so this is it's gonna be perfect. Okay, I'm now gonna try a my protein bar in the chocolate sundae. I think this is it. Yeah, I've tried the birthday cake flavor, but not the chocolate sundae one. And I really like the birthday cake one. And they have 20 grams of protein in, which is so cool. What I would highly, highly recommend is trying the vegan baked cookies from my protein. They're literally just like cake, like they're unreal. I'm gonna try this and see what it's like. Oh my god, two seconds. Yeah. So if I had the baked cookie right now, I mean, I have that right now, but let's see what we think. Hmm, very nice actually. It's kind of like cookie dough inside. It's sort of like cookie dough inside if you can tell. It's quite nice actually. I'm really enjoying this. Oh, I'm gonna eat this bar now. <laughs> it is currently 25 to 11. I literally don't fancy any food at all. Like my cold has completely done me out. I've never had a cold and felt like this. It's so weird. If anything, I usually get a cold and want more food, but I can feel my tummy is like hungry. What I could eat is a chicken katsu curry from Wagon Mama's. Mwah. But there's no way of me getting one of them unless I drove for 50 minutes, but no, actually longer than that. So we've just got Domino's, I've got, well, I was initially gonna get a personal size pizza and I've ended up getting a large pizza, so love that from me. Then I've got some chicken strippers and then I've also got some brownies in. I might eat in a bit, just when I how I feel, because once I've started eating, I might feel a bit better. You got me. But I've had some kind of food tablets, so I'm feeling a bit better because they sort of worn off earlier. That is what's going on. On. Usually I would eat so much more than this. I don't want you to think that I am restricting because I am not girls and boys <laughs> This is I got the margarita pizza and I actually got it thin and crispy I've never tried it from Domino's thin and crispy But I tried the Italian style last time and it just wasn't different at all So I thought I'd try this. I just didn't think I could stomach the thickness of a normal one And then I got some chicken strips. So I'm gonna scrun on this. I'm watching Love Island So it's gonna be brilliant. I've now got these little brownies Um, they've been in the fridge and I've just put them in the microwave. I've never tried these ones before. They're from um, Marks and Spencer's. So I'll do a little taste test. Oh god. Mmm. They're actually really good, aren't they? Yeah, they are. They were nice. So good. Highly recommend. Hey guys, it's the next day. Me, Papa Joe. Oh, you can't see the glasses in the way. I'm here. <laughs> and Benny. I'm here. I'm here. Do it, do it. <laughs> Um, I've come for breakfast and usually I'd get like a full English or like toast, beans, hash browns, scrambled eggs sort of thing But I've gone for pancakes, honey, yoghurt and mixed fruit, it looks so good Initially I was just gonna get the yoghurt with mixed fruit but I didn't realise it was on pancakes But these do look so good, like they look really yummy Because my throat, I just didn't really fancy that toast Yeah, this is Papa Joe's breakfast Fake plant, it's not even real <laughs> Dirty Hey guys, it's later on in the day and I've got a Mackey's, I've got a large diet coke, I've got myself 12 chicken nuggets, not 12, 20 chicken nuggets, and I've got a little mini Galaxy McFlurry with, oh, brilliant, with extra sauce, because extra sauce is just always the way to go, and if there's still not enough sauce in it, I have my own caramel sauce that I will put in it, and I kid you not, I genuinely keep a, ca a caramel and chocolate sauce in my car for this exact reason, that they never give me enough sauce in my McFlurries, and then I've got some barbecue sauce, so I'm gonna sit here and enjoy this, I didn't really fancy chips because of my stupid cold, so I more nuggets instead, you know, so good. Ooh, so we've come to the cinema, I've got a mixed hangout ice glass, large, sweet and salty, Popcorn! Let's go! We're watching a horror film, so I'm gonna be so scared. We're half an hour late. Good morning, you beautiful bunch of people. So, it's time for some breakfast. I'm gonna have, oh god, literally, because we live in like, I don't know, like a cottagey sort of home down here. Like, everything's so small, like, I can hit my head on this door. I ran through it once, not thinking, and I just scraped the top of my head. It was 
so painful. But anyway, I'm gonna have like a couple of brunch bars and strawberries for my breakfast, I think. Cause I'm not really like a scrambled egg toast sort of gal in the morning. I like like sweet food in the morning. So, and we don't have any, I don't know, we do have cereal, but I don't fancy cereal today. So I'm feeling a bit better this morning, which is good. Just sort of leftover of a uh, sore throat and stuff, so. We love that from me. I'm just feeling so hungry already. Also, I forgot to tell you last night that I ate a share bag of 12 bites at the cinema and then like on the way back as well. But I forgot to tell y'all. <laughs> I'm a crazy little lady, but I definitely did. And then it's really bad because my dog had a little bit of the chocolate as well, but it is poisonous. But Minnie's been eating it since she's been a little baby and she's fine. I think she's just a different breed. Minnie must be a superhero. How come these ones are from like a, a, a fruit farm? They were at co-op. Oh really? I thought you'd gone to like some fruit farm or something. Were they more expensive? No, the same price. That's why I bought one of each to see what would be the best flavour. Oh, okay. Best flavour. Yeah. Flavour. Ones from the fruit farm ones. We need to start investing in orange juice because every morning I want some bitty orange juice. Noted. Noted. Bon apple teeth, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Hey Vlogmas! I did not know you could do that. Sis, this is how it always is. Hey guys! We're so, going in. Oh, why is it flipping? It's because it's like a bit broken. We're going for a hydrofacial. This is our before. We're saying our skin is actually coming together really nicely. Yours looks really clear. It's looking so good. So is yours. So we're looking very fresh and we're really excited. We'll do some Ready. bits in there and then we'll show you like the after, but also afterwards, you're always a little bit red. Yeah, so. it brings it all out. Yeah, and then like the day after is when you get like your true results. So it's very exciting. <laughs> Wee, let's go, sir. it will help with scarring okay. um also reducing the bacteria like we all should do hey. thanks skincare queen <laughs> <laughs> she loves it that's her official <laughs> this is all the dirt in my skin oh my goodness where are you going <laughs> here's sis she's having her little light treatment i don't know what the pink one's for actually do you um, it might be scarring yeah, I don't know, but we both sort of have like little acne scarring on our cheeks. Well, I don't know, do you have it anymore? Yeah, I still got that. Yeah, I've got like little acne scarring, so that's what like the lights help with. We've actually finished earlier than expected, which is good because we I am dying for TGIs. Like, I literally am dying. We have our literally our little like routine is we go for a hydro facial, then we go for a TGIs because we are sucker for TGIs, aren't we, sis? I'm starving. I'm so hungry. Are you? Yeah, and the designated driver today. Like, immediate after results. So, obviously, we're looking, like, a little bit red and angry and stuff. But it feels but glowing. Good. And it looks so good. Mm. <laughs> you do be glowing. So, we have cheese and bacon potato skins. And mozzarella dippers. But Sasha doesn't actually like mozzarella dippers. She just wants one or two of these. So, we're going to have a little foodie snack. I wanted to get both of them because I was just so hungry. Um, I literally can't wait. I'm getting really angry now. <laughs> so we've got this. I've already started eating, but all oh, this. Yeah, good, good. Yeah, good. Thank you. I've got chicken sesame strips, and we did ask for extra lettuce, but I don't think we. No, we like the extra lettuce because it's like crunchy and so good. The cold and hot contrast, which is nice. And fries, we both get the same thing like every single time. It's got to be the go-to. So I feel like if we came and had something else, we'd be cheating the system. Oh, I know. <laughs> Our like facial lady Annabelle asked us today and last time to have the bonus chicken wings. And we just haven't oh, had them again. God. It's because we're just so obsessed with this that we just forget. We don't think about any other food. <laughs> So this is editing Brooke. This is the end of the video. Thank you so much guys for all watching. I love you all from the bottom of my heart. You guys are amazing. If you got more eat what I eat in a few days, etc., please do let me know. Please bear in mind that this wasn't a regular what I eat in a few days. But you know, I've got to show the realistic. I didn't want to just like not upload this video when you know this is the truth. So yeah, please, please, please comment, like, subscribe, and check out all my social medias because I really, really am trying to push all my social medias at the minute. That would mean the world to me. I love you all so much and I hope you're having the best day ever.